This is my sister. She's been trying to change her life and get healthier for quite some time now. And more than a year ago, I helped her with that and I gave her everything she needed and she failed. And she gained even more weight over the past year. I want her to be healthy, lose weight and completely change her life. This time I challenged her, 90 days to change your life with my help and constant supervision. 90 days to transform your physique. That's cool. I, I, that. I, I want to help you and I'm, I'm going to help you. And if she does it, well, she changed her life. Oh, and she wins 500 bucks. Let's weigh in. Okay. Oh my God. 94.4 kilograms and that is this in pounds. We also look at their body stats. These are the measurements. Which at this point means that she is severely overweight and obese. We also looked at her physical state and tested how fit she was. Come on, after this you're done. You dead? Yeah. I want to see you go all out and see how fast you can do it. You did it though. You kept going. You kept going. Okay. You ready? Sure. Which was almost unbelievable for me. It was bad. So things have to change. We set goals. Number one, lose weight. Quite a lot actually. Number two, eat healthier. Have a diet that fuels her body rather than one that destroys it. Number three, get more active. She actually didn't do a lot before this challenge, like nothing, and she has a sitting job, not optimal. And number four, make sure this is for the long term. Feel good, energized, and be happy. Now I told her about the cash money prize. As an extra motivation, there is a 500 bucks prize. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> you win 500 bucks? Really? Yes. That's yes. Amazing. Extra motivation, I didn't want to tell you before really seeing that you were honestly really motivated to do this. And I know, I know she is. Extra motivation. Thank you. Okay, good luck. Bye. Good luck. We started with introducing workouts, cardio, and obviously a diet. She's trying out new foods, new flavors of things, new supplements. This was actually a really fun part of the process. And from day one, the diet has actually been one of the easiest things ever. She really stuck to it for these 30 days. The workouts on the other end. Okay, show us a proper squat. I don't know how to do a proper squat. Show us the squat, show us your squat. Um, I'm not feeling it today at all. I just did 20 minutes on the treadmill and I'm supposed to do 40. She doesn't really like them. Well, she hates them. And I could see by the calories she was burning while working out, she wasn't really challenging herself during the workouts. It was more like getting them done as fast as possible and as easy as possible. In these first 30 days, she lost 5.5 kilograms. She is enjoying the workouts a lot more already and she's actually making crazy strength gains. She couldn't even do anything remotely close to knee push-ups or anything that looked like it. And right now, she's doing them. And she's finding ways to burn as many calories as possible. Some are questionable. And the diet is still going strong. She's tracking her calorie intake, I track it as well, and she's doing a great job. We're also sometimes experimenting with recipes that we find online. On day one, I also gave her micro tasks, like open curtains, make the bed and clean room real quick. And also that is going well for like 80, 90% of the time instead of almost never doing it. It's all about the change of that mindset. In these 30 days, she lost three kilograms. This was quite frustrating for her because she was putting in all the work, everything she needed to do, and she hoped for a little more result, a little more progress, but it 
didn't happen. She started the last 30 days off by making great progress. But she was also getting quite sick. So I burned over 900 calories, excess calories today. So I'm really happy that I did that even though I have a cold. I'm very proud of myself. I can't wait to see what my weight is tomorrow. The skill you see you're using is a pretty generic skill that just weighs your weight. I would have preferred to use the skill that I use that tracks everything. My weight, my fat percentage, my muscle percentage, my water weight, the weight of my bones, everything. But as we explained in part 1 she can't use this skill because of a heart condition. The skill uses an electrical current that goes through your body and measures everything. If you want to check the skill out, first link in description and make sure to use the code SBFIT for a crazy discount. First link in description. Hi guys, so I'm very sick but I really wanted to show my physique because I lost 10 kilograms. Yesterday I didn't do anything. Uh, third time in the whole like 90 day challenge or challenge like transformation because i pushed myself so much i did hit a record i burned 300 calories in like 32 minutes yeah i i don't do the crazy thing anymore that you saw me do like previous episode i just bumped up the speed so that 5.5 kilometers per hour anyways um i'm gonna make myself some tea to make my throat feel better so it's day three of being sick <coughs> I'm still not feeling my best, so I stayed home from work today. Just hopefully get rid of the sickness because I'm so tired of it and I just want to be able to work out normally again. It's crazy, like, I like my double chin. It's, it's nearly gone, I have to really go like that. The diet is the biggest part of your journey when it comes to weight loss and she has been doing insanely well. Also, in these 30 days, she's killing the diet. Most of the workout clothing she's wearing and the food you see like whey protein, oats, the bars and a lot more are from MyProtein. Make sure to check out the link in the description if you're interested. They're in every country and with code BROWNIE you get 35% off. How are you feeling? Boop. Enjoy. Thanks. She's feeling better and the workouts are going great. This month we focus more on cardio workouts and really getting her body into a fat loss state. So I just did my workout on the treadmill. I did do like a few sprints to really make sure I could hit calories I wanna in the amount of time I wanna. And like they were hard sprints because I never sprint. But I took a lot of time to just keep walking and catch my breath again and then just do it again. So yeah, it was a really good workout. And she found her new favorite lunch. All right, guys, I'm going to make protein pancakes right now and I'm gonna show you how I make them. So I'm gonna fill this up to about here. So right now I'm gonna put in protein pancake powder. And we're gonna do two scoops. Okay, so honestly, this is a really good meal because the protein, like the two scoops together are 160 calories and we use uh, almond milk. So this comes up to uh, 186 calories. So I might actually try this with protein chocolate. So right now I'm eating the pancakes with a little protein chocolate paste. Good morning, I just weighed in at 84.3 kilograms and yeah, that's more than I was. She's quite focused on the number that the skill says, which is not always a good thing because make also sure to look in the mirror and how you feel. And because she's so caught up with the number on the skill, she felt terrible because she was not losing any weight. She wanted to change her diet a little bit, so we did that. My eggs, I'm also having my yogurt with protein powder so i'm eating salmon and eggs but the number on the scale didn't change 
I'm, I'm really frustrated. Like, um, the first like seven minutes of my workout, I was just crying. <laughs> I know that sounds really stupid, but I've been doing a like protein diet for a week now, uh, except for last Thursday because we had my brother's birthday. So we did some fun stuff inside the house, of course. I'm not losing any weight while doing this. And I did this protein diet before and I lost two and a half kilograms. In a week. I also didn't film a lot the past few days because honestly there's not a lot going on. We're all supposed to stay inside. I'm not going to work. I'm working from home. Also I don't want to sound negative by all the things I just said but my parents have been telling me that I look really good which is really really motivating. I really like that. I've been playing a lot of soccer with Stan. Also he kicked my whole ankle full of bruises. Look. Look what he did. Stop, stop saying I was the one doing it. She was the one who was kicking against my <laughs> legs and she got the bruises. No, I'm just kidding. It was my own fault. We're on a walk right now. Stan is right there. You ready? Yes. Okay, let's go. The way in. There you go. There we go. Come on. But first, let me show you a clip that I recorded at the beginning of this journey. Okay, so today is the first day after we uploaded the first ever episode. We uploaded that and I've been getting a lot of questions about isn't 20 kilogram a lot to lose in 90 days, especially for women. And yes, 20 kilograms is, is quite a lot, but I, I did that on purpose. If she hits 15 kilograms, we smashed it in 90 days. I know my sister, and if I say 15 kilograms, she will be happy with 12. Now I know we're gonna smash it. And I wanna share this with you guys. I wanna reply to you guys, but, but I can't because she watches the videos as well. She smashes the link on that video well. 20 kilograms is a lot. And if she doesn't hit it, that doesn't mean that she's not gonna win the 500 bucks. It doesn't mean she's a failure. It's amazing. If she, if she loses 10 kilograms, it's insane. 15 kilograms, it, it's, it's, it's crazy. Step on it. Eight, oh, 80.8. That's a total of almost 14 kilograms. Yeah, 13.6. Cool. All right, so yeah, basically the clip they just watched said that the real goal for this entire transformation was not 20 kilograms, but 15 kilograms. It's not that they're six kilogram off or no, you're around 14 kilograms, so that's one kilogram off the goal. I'm proud as well. Okay, so. These are the measurements. Sick. In these 90 days, she lost 14 kilograms. That's crazy. She feels so much better and really changed the way she lives completely. It's so awesome to see how much happier and confident she's gotten. She's a warrior. And that's why Let's do it. Let's just do it. Hello? Check what's on the phone. Check the notification. Oh. Why? <laughs> he deserved it. Oh, thank you so much.